Hi, I'm Morten Nielsen from the WASP team, and in this video I'm going to talk about license for WinFarm Assessment Tool. Uh, until now it has been uh, uh, a free program, uh, but uh, we have spent many hours developing it, and uh, according to um, the university rules, then we have to, uh, to make it uh, not completely free anymore. And the reason is, of course, that we don't want to uh, be accused of unfair competition with uh, private software developers. So you need a license, and uh, but we decided that it should not be a new license for what, but we will just check that you have a WASP license, and you need that to generate data for uh, wind farm assessment tools anyway, so I hope that it's not going to be too uh, inconvenient for existing users. So uh, if it's uh, uh, not licensed, then it will be shown in the title bar here. Uh, unlicensed. You'll still be able to open projects and create new ones. It's just that we uh, kind of hide the results. Like if I have the production data, then you can see that you can no longer read them, so it's not so useful anymore. So you probably need a license. And you can click here Help and License Status. And if it's not registered, then there's a little a checklist here of what to do. You need to download the WASP 11 software and uh, get a license for it and uh, here at this you do it from this uh, home page here and there's also some guidelines on uh, how to install these uh, the, both the software and the license and um, then you also you need to go to uh, to wasp and uh, make the license uh, register it here and you do it uh, here under help and then this menu licensing uh, pops up and then you go register and then uh, you click on this uh, um, key file here with uh, with your personal license and uh, you also need to be on the internet and then there's a database which checks that you have the uh, that you have only installed it on one computer uh, if you need it on two then you can uninstall and then uh, install it on the other one but anyway, now it should be ready here, and uh, then uh, the next step is uh, then you should uh, you should restart uh, WinFarm Assessment Tool, and then uh, everything should work as normal.